Welcome to Chemistry Concept and now let's discuss about Riemann-Thiemann reaction. First of all, let's have a look at what is the Riemann-Thiemann reaction actually. It is a reaction of phenol. This phenol reacts with CHCl3 which is nothing but chloroform in the presence of thiamol of KOH or NaOH that means any alkali at 340 Kelvin temperature to give sodium salt of salicylaldehyde. which on obviously treatment with water gives salicylaldehyde which is nothing but hydroxy benzaldehyde okay it is salicylaldehyde now now okay uh, there's an interesting point that if i replace this chloroform with CCl4 carbon tetrachloride, the end product which I'll be getting is salicylic acid. Yes, the salicylic acid which is used for the formation of very famous aspirin. Okay, salicylic acid. So what is the difference? This group, aldehyde group is converted into carboxylic group. Now let's have a look at the mechanism, but what is the a scene behind this Riemann-Thiemann reaction? What happens in the very first step of a C CHCl3 chloroform reacts with a um, base to give uh, this intermediate, the base abstracts hydrogen leaving behind this carbon, this anion, which further disintegrate to give this intermediate okay now in the way in, in on the other hand in the you can say in the next step uh, this phenol in the presence of base gets converted into phenoxide ion okay this phenoxide ion when reacts with our the intermediate form the verb we get Let me write it. Okay, this intermediate product. Okay. Now in the way in the next step, what happens that this hydrogen moves to this position and uh, there's rearrangement taking place, giving rise to C, Cl, Cl, H here and then pi bonds at this position. Okay. Now the next step again, KOH, another mole of KOH comes in the play and uh, this simple O negative and what happens that this base now replaced uh, any of the two chloride, chlorines to give C, OH. Cl H, which further uh, removes a HCl molecule forming O negative C O C L C O H. Okay, and this again on reaction with water gives us. Salicylaldehyde. Okay, so this was the mechanism. Stay tuned for more videos and don't forget to subscribe. Chemistry concept. Thank you.